Continuing where we left off, we went to get a bite to eat. Here is the depot here in Hartwell. As you can see, it's a little worse for wear, but it's still standing. And what's interesting is it still has the, the old um, Hart County Scenic Railroad emblem up on the train board. And it even still has the old uh, trains they would have had up here. But yeah, this scenic operation folded in the late eight, by the mid-80s due to the track conditions. So... I know a friend of mine who works for the railroad is hoping to try and get that started it back up again one day. Actually, I think that's from one of the, uh, I don't know if that's from a restaurant, if that was on the train, I don't think it was, but there was the boarding platform there, and then there's the telegraph windows, there's the waiting room, and they have people working here, so I might just do a walk around to the depot, and I mean, if they tell me to leave, you know, I will, I'm not going to oversay my welcome if I'm not welcome, so... I think they might actually be trying to work on it, which is nice. Yeah, they gotta have a picnic table. So yeah, this would have been where you would have uh, boarded the train here. Cars would have, train would have pulled in on this track and you would have boarded the train right here. It's a shame. But, there's not much one can really do. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. Now I'll uh, pause the video and uh, I'll go uh, get down to where the, one of the few passenger cars from the operation is still at. Well, not still at, it's where one of the passenger cars are still um, parked. So, uh, yeah, see y'all in a bit. And by the way, that's uh, my truck there. I'm learning how to drive with it, so uh, yeah. I'm going to pause the video and I'll see y'all in a minute. Alright, so here is the old Erie Lackawanna multiple unit car that was, I guess, bought by the Hartwell back in the 80s when they were when it was retired. You can see they had it painted blue and then there's a caboose behind that that's in really sad shape. It's a wood caboose, so it's not exactly in the best of shape. There's the old emblem there. There's the inside there. Yeah, I'm having to do this quick because my battery on my phone is dying rather quickly, but yeah. Oh dang, that got worse since I was here last. That thing's gonna fall in before they can save it. I'm afraid Zena's gonna have to let that fix. I don't want them to scrap this, but there's no way they can save this unless we, they get the frame and rebuild it from the ground up. So yeah, here's the turntable that's right here behind all this. In fact, here's the caboose, and actually you can see just how sad of a shape it's in. But yeah, there's the turntable. I think they would have had that turned by hand, if I'm not mistaken. Either that or they probably had a small motor. And there's another little siding there. And then here's the main line, which actually was, from what my friend told me, was stabilized recently so they could get the engine and some cars back here. <coughs> <coughs> so that's nice. Yeah, here's a better view of the turntable. God, I wish I knew where they found this. So, Zena, if you see this video, could you let me know about where you guys got this? God, that thing's a beauty. They got something over there. I don't know if that's like a generator that they use to operate the thing or what, but, yeah. Here's the caboose, and here's the other side of the uh, passenger car. I wish I had my cannon with me so I could get better pictures. So, yeah, that's the uh, end of the video because my battery's about to die. So, uh, yeah. See y'all later. Hopefully this stuff gets saved.